Advent at La Lande, where we have been celebrating Sinterklaas. That is the Dutch and Belgian tradition that is the forerunner of Santa Claus. But they celebrate it early in December, and for them, it has nothing to do with Christmas. The name Santa Claus is just an abbreviation of Saint Nicholas, and it was the early Dutch settlers who took that tradition to New York. In the 1770s, the New York Gazetteer wrote that the descendants of the Dutch still celebrate the day of Saint A. Claus, and that is what in the future led to the revival of Saint Nicholas and the creation of Santa Claus in North America. The original, Saint Nicholas, was the Bishop of Mira and he became the patron saint of children. Unlike Santa Claus, Saint Nicholas travels by horse, but the horse does still go on the rooftops and he still delivers the gifts by chimneys. Now once he's got them into the house, they do not go into stockings, they go into shoes. So children have to leave their shoes out for him. And last night, Philip planned the most adorable Santa Claus party for Annalise's children and Mark and Amy's children. And it was really, really magical. The organization fell entirely to Philip because yesterday I was madly subtitling a video on my new channel, Stephanie's Grand Tour of Europe, which is going to premiere straight after this one. It is an extraordinary tour given by the owner of the best preserved palace of the Dukes and Duchesses of Burgundy. They were the richest Dukes in France in the Middle Ages, so to step into their home with the owner was an extraordinary privilege. He gave the whole tour in English. He's a very passionate historian, incredibly knowledgeable, but he has a very strong French accent and I was worried that some people might not grasp every word. And as it is so interesting, I decided that I would make the subtitles at the last minute. So I couldn't help Philip and the evening turned out to be just as magical for me as for the children because I didn't know what to expect. Because that Chateau tour is premiering tonight, we're moving Caddo at the Chateau to tomorrow night. So with no further ado, I will leave you with us into class festivities and I would just like to say to all of the Dutch and Belgians out there, find us into class. Oh, it is looking beautiful in here. Who did this? Uh, Emery made the fire and Jared and I brought the furniture back and then it looks so nice. All of these, th these things from the Netherlands, my mother uh, sent. She sent no. even more. So we're going to celebrate Santa Claus. So Clément is here, Juliette is here with Mark and Amy. Oh. And Elise, did your mother uh, even send the plates? Yes. And uh, she is Elise so is lovely. Here. When they come in here, I'm going to ask them to put the shoe in front of the fire. I'm trying to like mix two traditions of Santa Claus because usually it's, it's overnight and in the morning yeah. you come down and your shoe that's like a little gift, but. As we're doing it all in one go. All in one go. Uh, <laughs> they're going to put their shoe in front of the fire, and then they're going to happen. What's going to happen is what I used to have when I was a kid, which is that we'd be waiting for the class, and we'd all be chatting and stuff, and it'd be sweets, and then it'd be knock on the door or on the window, and it was the class was there. So you'd run outside and uh, could never find him ever. We'd always just miss him. We would come in, and, and my parents would be like, "Oh, look." He, he just left. He had to go and see the other children. What we're going to do is we'll do exactly that. Knock on the window. And when they get back, there'll be all the sweets my mother sent. So like chocolate letters, chocolate oh, candy. So adorable, um, honestly. Yeah. I just didn't realise the whole room has been transformed. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Jared. No problem. And look how good the floor is looking now. It's just so red and glorious and shiny and lovely. This smells like my childhood, by the way. Do you know what it all is? <laughs> uh, I know what this is. I remember this because your mother sent it last year. Mm. It looks like a sausage roll, but it's actually marzipan instead of sausage meat inside. It's delicious. This is a type of um, frangipani gingerbread by almond paste. Mm -hmm. Speculous covered with chocolate. Uh, no, they're uh, paper nuts. It's so like ginger yeah, nuts. Yeah, that's, yeah, ginger nuts. Regular ginger nuts with, with sweets is how we usually get it. Mm -hmm. This is just like foamy, sugary stuff. Yeah. There's like chocolate with like a sugary thing inside. Mm -hmm. This is just sugar with flavoring. And that's Thai Thai. That's also like the a... The poor parents. This has got like anise seed in it. Their night is going to be a nightmare. <laughs> when someone's going to knock on the window and the kids will go out that way and go in here. Look, they've got individual little bags. These are chocolate letters with a little poem. He's wrote a poem for each yes. child. It's a little 
chocolate Santa oh, Claus. Man, I'm all of this. And there's way more like sweets in there. Well, let's get the children in. Yes. It's going to and be chaos. Also something for us. So in there are all the chocolate letters for all of us. You've also got bees. I've got bees. I love bees. Yeah, me too. I've got bee bedding as well. I just. I love, I just love bees at the moment. We're both going full on with bees at I the love moment. It. Bees are amazing. I feel like the Pied Piper. Yeah. Only rats would have been quieter. <laughs> Oh, Welcome to Santa Claus. Shall we eat some? Come on, get this big one. Shall we get some? Ooh. Amory, really you have made a cracking fire. I don't think I've ever seen it quite so sky high, but we can go crazy now that we know we've got a sparkling, leakling <laughs> chimney. She can take it. Mine was a guitar. Is it good? It's so good to see the winter salon being used again. Cheers, guys. Sweets for the children, whiskey for us. Very necessary when the sweets for the children. <laughs> Is this Dutch music playing in the background? Yes, it's Dutch in the class music. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> We're waiting for Santa Claus, and Santa Claus is the Dutch cousin of Santa. Wow! And he said he'll drop by and bring some sweets to all the kids who have been good this year. Have you been good? Have you been good? Have you been good? We've been good. So if you hear a knock on the window, that means that he'll be here. In the Netherlands, instead of hanging your stocking on the fireplace, you put your shoe in front of the fireplace so that, that Santa, Santa Claus, knows where to put the sweets. Right. So do you want to put your shoe in front of the... Do you put your shoe? Just one. So the wellies off straight away. Quite a big one. That's that's very clever to have a wellie. <laughs> you can tell we're in the countryside, can't you? Yeah. Seriously, all three were wearing wellies. <laughs> That wasn't pre-arranged. No, it? That I was know. It's amazing. I was like, yeah. get the shoes on. They were like, can we go in wellies? And I was like, are they clean? They were like, yeah. And I was like, fine. Are you excited, Davy, for Santa Claus? Sensational. Oh, did you hear that? What's that, Clement? I think it was Santa Claus. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I heard a knock. Okay, let's go outside. Let's have a look. He hasn't got much time because he has to be with all the other children. So let's quickly look for it. You wouldn't believe they only just met these three, would you? <laughs> no, they're like lifelong bodies. More shoes up here, are you serious? <laughs> That's Clemmer. I'm not going to do it like that. This is really sweet. It's quite an adorable tradition, isn't it? That is very sweet, yeah. Hurry, they'll be back soon. <laughs> When he come back, oh, he's just left, just him. Oh, there's a just left, they've just missed him. It's for all of us. Oh. He's having a wine of a time. He's having <laughs> the best time. <laughs> You're very calm amidst the storm. It is a storm, all those children in here. <laughs> <laughs> That's why the rum came out after the whiskey. <laughs> what happened? You just missed him. No. He was oh, here. We just missed him. Oh, oh, no. oh but look. Look, he left look gifts. Here. Look at your boots. Oh, just some of the boots. Wow! That one is mine. Yes. Let's see. Oh. Let's see. That's his clever. And there's a little pen on the baby pen. Sim was thinking what to give to Jack a dinosaur, a racing car, or a sugary snack. He checked with Spider Man to see what he'd need. No dinosaur, no racing car. But on the sweets, they agreed. Sint won't hold you up. So without further ado, I suggest Jack gets up and checks what Sint's left in his shoe. Is that yummy? You say thank you. Thank you. <laughs> on December the 5th, Sint was trying to find Clemon. And to his surprise, he found him at Lenon. Compared to last year, Clemon had been even better. So, Sim decides to reward him with a chocolate letter. Wow! If next year Clement is just as good, Sint has promised to put some more candy in his boots. Wow! That's from Santa Claus. Are you going to say thank you, Santa Claus? <laughs> what does Thomas like, Sint asked Batman. 
who responded, Paw Patrol and going for a ride in his dad's van. You love that, don't you? Sin asked, wouldn't he rather have a chocolate letter? And they agreed. They said that would be better. Sin has said that if you are a good to your mother, he will bring you more sweets next year for you and your brother. Santa Claus. We've lost him. <laughs> well, I really appreciate that. That was brilliant. And Santa Claus didn't just leave something for the kids. I think he also left oh, something yeah. else, I think. Were we all good enough? I, I, we'll see. Oh. We'll see. Right. I sent my report card in. Anne-Marie. Oh. Oh, I don't oh, think there you go. Oh. Oh. There you go. Oh. Thank you. S. Stephanie. Thank you. Here you go. I think my mother just. Oh, I think Santa Claus. <laughs> Couldn't find all the letters. <laughs> Put some others in. Let me see. Ah, oh, A and Elise. Oh, thank there you, you go. Very much. Thank you. Why don't you Thank you very much. <laughs> so that's Santa Claus. That's his horse. And that's his friend. Oh, I didn't realise that they would work as backpacks. That is really I mean, that's Thomas's design. I love that. Well, it's a very good thing. Later. We're safe. <laughs> 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 I find what he chocolate. That looks like a very good one.